pregnancy can be a strange and uncertain time. Just as 27-year-old Instagram influencer and YouTuber Chloe Dunstan from Perth, Australia. Back in 2015, Chloe and her husband Rohan Dunstan were overjoyed to discover that Chloe was pregnant for the fourth time. They already had three little sons, Evan, Otto, and Felix, but they had always dreamed of having a daughter, and it seemed like fate might finally be on their side. But when Chloe attended a routine examination just six weeks into her pregnancy, nothing could prepare her for what she was about to discover. Then 22-year-old Chloe was no stranger to ultrasound procedures. This was her fourth child after all, so she wasn't anticipating anything major. But the scan she received didn't look anything like the ones from her previous pregnancies. A few moments after the ultrasound technician got started on the routine examination, she finally said, I'll tell you what I can see. I can see a baby over there, then moving the device over slightly, and another baby over there. But that wasn't all. What was supposed to be Chloe's fourth and final baby was actually about to be her fourth, fifth, and sixth because the technician revealed that she'd be having triplets. Once she'd gotten over the initial shock that her number of kids was about to double, not to mention the extra cost of diapers, Chloe was overcome with emotion and couldn't wait to meet her new babies. But it wasn't going to be plain sailing. Over the coming weeks and months, Chloe's stomach continued to grow to an immense size until the poor girl looked like she was going to burst at any moment. At the next exam, 28 weeks into the pregnancy, the Dunstans learned their dream would soon become a reality. They were going to have two more sons and finally a little girl too. But there was a problem. Although Chloe's official due date was in September, she'd been told that she was expected to give birth a month or two early, which is usually the case with triplets. The family had already set about redesigning and renovating their home to make room for their three new additions, but it seemed like that future was now hanging in the balance when doctors revealed something terrifying. Unfortunately, not all of the babies had developed properly in the womb and Chloe and Rohan learned that their baby girl was in serious trouble. Although the two boys were on track to be born happy and healthy, the female fetus was underdeveloped according to medical expectations at this stage of the pregnancy. It seemed like things were going to be touch and go as the weeks progressed, and the Dunstans learned that their daughter was below the 10th percentile for size and a couple of weeks behind her siblings in development. When they realized the little girl was being deprived of the valuable oxygen and nutrients to help her grow properly, Chloe was tasked with a decision no mother should have to make. Doctors explained that the girl might not make it unless Chloe had an emergency cesarean section, but the same surgery could be fatal for the boys. Her options seemed grim risk all three babies to give her little girl a chance at life or sacrifice her daughter's life to ensure the safety of her two siblings. After doing some thorough research, Chloe decided to give birth to all three babies via C-section. They all arrived safely, but were immediately placed in intensive care after receiving blood transfusions. Henry, the largest baby, was just over three pounds, and his brother Rufus was 2.6 pounds. But little Pearl was almost half of Henry's weight at just over one and a half pounds. Pearl's fight was far from over, and she battled a pulmonary hemorrhage, a minor brain bleed, nasty infections, and metabolic bone disease, which was resolved with medication. Over the next nine weeks, Pearl and her brothers continued to grow stronger each day until the boys were fit enough to go home. And finally, Little Pearl was allowed to join them two weeks later. Although Chloe has said she felt guilty at first about potentially risking the lives of her boys, she doesn't regret her decision and she couldn't live with herself if she hadn't at least tried to save her daughter. After all, it seems like a mother's instincts are never wrong. Henry, Rufus, and Pearl have since grown up to be happy and healthy four-year-olds. But the Dunstans delivered yet another unexpected surprise in 2020. In an Instagram post on May 9th, the couple revealed that Chloe is pregnant again. And this time, it's twins. Although the Aussie mom had her tubes tied soon after the miracle birth of her triplets, she underwent a reverse procedure when she realized she wasn't done building her perfect family quite yet. The Dunstans are confident that they're now prepared for any curveballs Chloe's pregnancy might throw at them and they can't wait to introduce the new babies to their six excited siblings. Now that's what I call a full house. Chloe Dunstan isn't the only one to get the surprise of her life after receiving an ultrasound though. In fact, most scans don't exactly look how you might expect. Let's take a look at some more ultrasounds that seemingly revealed something strange and shocking. Demon Baby. 
In August 2019, 17-year-old Yana Carrington from Richmond, Virginia went into her ultrasound appointment hoping to find out the sex of her baby. But what she saw on screen almost made her pass out from shock. At first, Carrington was overjoyed to learn that she'd be having a baby girl. But when it looked up and smiled at the camera, she wasn't sure whether her baby was human at all. What she saw staring back at her looked more like a demon with wide set eyes and a terrifying grin. Thankfully, the technician quickly reassured Carrington that the photo was totally normal despite the spooky appearance, as most babies tend to hide from the camera. In fact, other scans showed that Carrington's daughter was a normal looking baby after all. Following the initial shock, Carrington saw the funny side and uploaded the scan on Facebook where it instantly went viral. She wrote, I love this devil baby so much already. What a touching sentiment. Divine Intervention Sometimes it isn't just the baby that catches our attention, and one Pennsylvania couple were shocked and humbled by an unexpected special guest in their ultrasound image in August 2017. When expectant mother Alicia Zeke received this scan, her eyes weren't immediately drawn to her own child, but to the presence behind her. Although they aren't particularly religious, both Alicia and her partner Zachary Smith couldn't deny the presence of a robed figure at the left side of the scan, which looked a lot like Jesus himself. The couple's previous children had both been born with birth defects. Their daughter has preaxial polydactyly, causing two thumbs on one hand, while their son was born with a cleft palate. They took the remarkable scan as a sign that their new baby was being safely watched over, and sure enough, baby Briella was born fit and healthy soon afterwards. Baby with an attitude. Newborn babies appear to be so innocent and oblivious to the world around them, but it seems like we might underestimate them. This hilarious scan, which shows the fetus literally flipping off its parents, belongs to Janine and Ryan Godfrey from Milton, Massachusetts. Talk about having an attitude problem before you've even been born. Still, it could be worse. Just take a look at this troublesome tot who's clearly had enough of the state of the world before she's even entered it. 22-year-old Lauren Brown and her partner Che from Aberdeen could hardly believe it when they were handed this scan at 19 weeks but they took it as a sign that their future daughter was a real character. Apparently, flipping the bird isn't such a rare occurrence in ultrasounds, because in May 2020, pop star Katy Perry also revealed that her unborn baby with fiance Orlando Bloom had already given her the middle finger. Maybe she's just sick of hearing her sing her own greatest hits at night. Bunny in the Oven in 2016, a mystery 33-year-old Florida mom-to-be turned to Reddit under the username NetFraulein to share a hilarious moment from her seven-month scan. The expectant mother was nervous at first because she had lost two babies in the past, but when she received the scan and saw what looked like a tiny bunny in her stomach, she and her partner couldn't help but laugh. She wrote, went for my first ultrasound today. Turns out I'm having a bunny. Ironically, the baby was even due in April, about a week before Easter of that year. You guys do realize the phrase, added like rabbits, isn't supposed to be taken literally, right? Something to tweet about. Okay, so cheating with Peter Rabbit might result in a literal bunny in the oven, but Reddit user Alice Asia was left totally stumped when she received this ultrasound scan back in 2013. How on earth did Woody the Woodpecker get in there? I'll bet she told the so-called father the feathers on the bed were from a pillow fight. According to medically trained eyes, this bizarre ultrasound can be easily explained. The baby's head is actually towards the bottom, while the pecker is its legs, with the white part being the thigh bone. The black part on the left, which looks like a giant alien eye, is just amniotic fluid, while the other eye is the bladder. Don't you just love the miracle of bird? I mean, birth. Duck and Cover As if that wasn't strange enough, check out this ultrasound which was shared by Reddit user Boss Cog in 2013. Apparently, the soon-to-be parents hadn't thought of a name for their baby before the scan was done, but after receiving this photo, they referred to it as Ducky until they did. Don't freak out though. This mother didn't accidentally swallow a rubber duck during a long soak in the tub. Armchair detectives have guessed that the scan was probably taken early on, and the duck's head is actually what's known as the yolk sac which acts as a source of nutrients before the placenta takes over, while the fetus itself is the plus signs, which are used to measure the length from crown to rump. I guess scans like these are the reason why they say you're expecting a baby. Truth is, you never know exactly what you're gonna get. Fast in the fetus. So spotting an animal intruder in your ultrasound is one thing, 
but one expectant father was totally dumbfounded in 2016 when his wife's 23-week scan seemed to reveal that she was pregnant with a sports car. The man shared the image under the username Brewhouse3223 and the image instantly went viral. He explained that he and his wife already had a daughter who was conceived through IVF, and when his wife fell pregnant six months later, they saw it as a total miracle. But the pair couldn't help but laugh at this bizarre scan. Often when the scans are taken early on, folds of the placental tissue around the fetus can be mistaken for all sorts of things, which is what likely caused this really amusing mix-up. Pregnant with a Predator Speaking of seeing things that aren't really there, a phenomenon known as periodolia, 29-year-old Leanne Sullivan was both shocked and amused to see what looked like a dinosaur growing alongside her unborn daughter Ruthie Lou in this ultrasound. Apparently, Sullivan didn't notice what is so clearly a mini brontosaurus inside her belly until her friends noticed the scan displayed on her fridge. Thankfully, the so-called dino is nothing but a trick of the light, and Sullivan didn't actually end up birthing a massive extinct thunder lizard alongside her daughter. But ironically, the scan did show up a month before the new Jurassic World film hit the big screen in 2015. It's a sign. Haunting Presence most strange ultrasounds can be easily explained and laughed off with friends, but this one gave the internet straight up chills in 2016. The scan was originally uploaded to Reddit with the caption, a friend's ultrasound, when you see it. So we can't be sure exactly who it belongs to, but that didn't stop people from dissecting it online anyway. In case you haven't noticed yet, it's not the baby itself that makes this photo so eerie. Just check out the ghostly presence looming behind it. People came up with various explanations for the figure, including a sinister demon, a Hindu goddess, a guardian angel, or even a friendly mermaid. No one can be certain what caused this bizarre appearance, but if the baby really is the Antichrist, what are the chances its mother is named Rosemary? Do you know anyone who got more than they bargained for in their ultrasound? Let me know in the comments below, and thanks for watching.